Memphis native straight drop might be going down as 2022's dumbest criminal ever. So let's talk about what led us to this point. After a short beef between Soldier Boy and Young Dolph, Soldier Boy finds himself putting the amount of money on Young Dolph's head. And similar to the position that Go Yayo played when dealing with Soldier Boy, straight drop in a sense fills that void. One of the most important voids that he feels is the link between PRE and Soldier Boy. A lot of people don't understand the significance of this photo of straight drop with this scarf around his body. It's actually to show you that at some point he had ties with Young Dolph's camp. Some feel that the bag that Soldier Boy put on the table and possibly doubled up or tripled up behind the scenes pushed him into making this move. Y'all signed to Empire. Y'all not independent. I'm independent. I'm not signed to Empire. I'm not signed to no independent label, no major label. I put my own music out through SODMG Records and get 100% of all the money. Ricky Morty, all the money. I'm really independent. So what the f*** this really about? This get yeah, mad because I come in the comments and say, that's Cap. You signed to Empire. Where the lie at? Yeah. Is you not signed to Empire? You signed to Empire. You not independent. As soon as I post that. Hop in my DM, are oh, you funny? Oh, dude, what's up, dude? Start talking. So they mad they signed. So they mad that they signed. Come on, man. Dolph mad because he signed the Empire <laughs> and I exposed him. That's what it's really about. That's what it really about. This mad because he signed to a motherfucking record deal and his whole thing is I'm independent, I'm independent. You did I lie? You signed the Empire, stupid. Why the you mad? <laughs> Following shortly after this outburst by Soldier Boy online, Young Dolph visits Memphis for his turkey giveaway. Unfortunately, this will be his last visit to Memphis. When he stopped by a cookie shop that he frequents while home in Memphis, he was caught outside of his vehicle with nothing but the glass of the storefront to protect him. Now, what's being captured on surveillance footage is what brings us on down to straight drop. The two-door white Mercedes that was used in the Young Dolph situation was found at a home that Straight Drop used for a music video, which in actuality is nowhere near a music video. It's basically the same clip looping over and over and over again. Another piece of unthought out planning was the fact that he wore the same hat that he wears in a music video for another one of his close friends in Memphis. And to put the icing all over the cake, his vehicle was seen passing back by surveillance in his work at the cookie shop there's a warrant out for his arrest but at this point no one knows about his whereabouts but if this plays out the way that it seems he's got to go down as the dumbest criminal of 2022 you wore the same clothes parked the vehicle at the same house and you did what most dumb criminals do return to the crime scene you sir i nominate you the dumbest criminal of 2022 but as more details emerge i'll keep you up Dated. So much ice, I should have brought my fur. After the club, I might leave with her.